You know, well, I'm a chicken fried. A cold beer on a Friday night. A pair of jeans that fit just right. Yo, what up, guys? It's your boy HB here. I'm back doing a top 10 NFL. Don't want you to see what all my got here, but, um, yeah, it's going to be a good video. Got my, got different sections. Got, um, top 10 games of week 12, game of the week, and HB picks, which, of course, is top, my top five teams that I rank as being the highest in the NFL. If you haven't watched my college video, um, I did the same, just basically the same exact thing. Um, go check that out, guys. Um, that's probably my most recent video. But um, anyway, yeah. Starting off with um, number one game of week 12, we have eight and nine Patriots versus the um, New York Giants. I chose this game because Patriots are obviously one of the best teams in the NFL. They're in um, HB picks at the end of the vid. Um, stay tuned for that. Um, next, we have New York Giants facing Patriots. Who New York Giants are five and four guys. Um, I guess it's a good record. I guess they have the potential to go to the playoffs. But um, yeah, New York Giants, Patriots, number one. Next, we have. Bengals versus Texans. Before I go on any further, I just wanted to state that all these games are my opinion, what I think are the best. Um, this is not coming from any like definite source. This is not coming from NFL. I've chose these based on record and um, how close the records were, basically. Um, ne next we have, at number two, we have Bengals 8 0 no, um, versus 3 and 5 Texans. Obviously, Bengals ain't no they're being a good team. Um, I don't, I really don't think Bengals are that good, but uh, I don't know. I guess the Bengals will more than likely beat the Texans. Next at number three, this game might surprise you being over the um, two games below it. I have um, Seahawks versus uh, Cardinals. Um, two evenly matched teams: Cardinals being six and two, Seahawks being four and four. Turning Super Bowl champs, um, Cardinal or Seahawks, um, almost champions. I don't know if you caught that, but um, almost the champions if they'd uh, ran that ball instead of passed it. But uh, yeah. Next off, we have Denver seven and one versus Kansas City. Um, I just think uh, Kansas Kansas City is not not a bad team. They've had some tough losses, guys. But um, yeah, other than that, they're a pretty good team. Um, the other one, or Denver, their opponent, seven and one. Um, I, they're in HB picks. I'm not gonna tell you the exact um location, but um, yeah, they're in there, guys. Um, next one we have are Panthers versus Titans. This one's low because um Titans are two six. Not gonna be real. It's gonna be more of a domination, really. Panthers being um eight and zero. Oh, Titans being uh two and six. Sorry about my allergies, guys. Um. Didn't get my allergy shots today. Next we have um, six and two Vikings taking to Oakland. Pretty um, pretty pretty well matched um teams guys. Um, Vikings being six and two, Oakland being four and four. Next we have Packers versus Lions. Lions obviously being the worst team in the NFL. Packers being uh they're up there in my HB picks. I'll tell you that uh, HB picks is top five team. So obviously they're they're up there. But um yeah. Next we have New York Jets probably. Probably an underthought of team, I'd say, guys. But um, yeah, we have New York Jets versus uh Buffalo Bills. Buffalo Bills four and four, New York Jets five and three. That's gonna be a pretty well matched um game. I don't know if you guys will watch that game, but I probably will be watching that game. Um, uh, next we have another well matched team, Saints and Redskins. A lot of these well matched teams are teams that um teams that are a little lower in the rankings, but they're still they'll still be close, good games to watch. Next we have Five and four Steelers. Um, uh, Steelers are five and four. They've had some tough losses to some tough teams, um, being Bengals, Patriots, and those are just being those are just some of the hard teams they lost to. And that's the um, end of the that section. Next we have um, the Cardinals versus the Seahawks. Cardinals, um, Cardinals versus Seahawks. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be one of the well-matched games that NFL is going to bring us, and I think it's going to be a good one to watch. I got that one down as a 35-20. to 20. I do the score for the uh, games of the week. 
So yeah, I got 35-20. Um, then we have Patriots versus Giants. I got that 45-24. That would be the uh, runner-up of the game of the week, but I still got them in there. So um, yeah. Um, next we have Patriots versus, or next we have the um, HB picks actually, not as in HB wide receiver or um, HB or not HB. Um, what was I saying? HB not as in um, interceptions, but HB my top ten five picks. Coming up at number one we have the um, Patriots. Um, Patriots, all-around good team. Some of their highlights of their wins. Not really a really good schedule, but they've got um, Colts and the Jets. Um, next off, we have the uh, Panthers. Panthers have a couple of good wins, guys. Um, Packers versus Seahawks. Those are some okay teams. Um, Broncos, 7-1. and one. I know you were expecting to hear Bengals, but I'll explain why in a minute. Broncos lost to the Colts. Oh, that was kind of an upset, really. Um, lost to the Colts. Um, went to the Packers six and two, Vikings six and two. Um, and yeah. Uh, next we have finally Bengals. Bengals are number four because of the um, weak schedule they have, guys. It's really um, they got a really weak schedule going on. And sorry, just looking at something in here. They have um a really weak schedule. And that's why they're only number four. Packers, um, Packers, Packers six and two. I mean, they're an okay team. They're not. They're the number five team, and because they lost to the Panthers and the Broncos, and those are both really excellent teams this year. And if that's their only two loss, I wouldn't be. I wouldn't be. I wouldn't be mad at that, guys. So that's why the Packers are number five, and that concludes. NFL talk with um, HB Beast. I hope you guys enjoy this. Let me know. This is honor of um, this is honor of Sports Week with your boy HB on his channel. Um, uh, get that name out right there. Give you a good good time. Make sure you get it. And we're done. Um, I just want to say shout out to my boy Carson Burgess or Silent Haas. Um, making some cool videos. I think he has Fallout 4, new game, um, Black Ops 3, new game that came out too. So go check out his channel if you want some um, Black Ops 3 footage. I know I'm I'm excited to see some of that, guys. I'm waiting on him to upload some of that. But um, yeah. Um, subscribe, like, do all the good stuff you know to do, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog that I'll do probably Friday.